I performed in the pageant where Sharon was bringing her crown where I stole her crown. You need to tell that story. I didn't actually steal the crown. My friend <laughs> stole the crown. <gasps> Don't say the name. He's not famous, no one knows who he is. Sharon was there in Atlanta judging a pageant and of course, as you do, you wear your crown to judge the pageant and you give the scores and it was very official. I was backstage and my friends were all backstage, you know, like helping me. It was like loose security back in the day. We go to another bar after this club called Jungle called Burkhart at the time. And I remember my friend specifically drove a black Mercedes. It was a bunch of my friends and they were like, we got you something. And I was like in full like clown drag. They're like, yeah, yeah, we got you something. And I remember them being like, if this is Sherry Needle's crown, I'm gonna kill you and they pop the trunk of their Mercedes and it's literally Sharon's crown like sparkling at me in like a black Mercedes backseat and I'm like, no. No ma'am. And then we were like watching the next season cause it was like back in the day, it was like a, it was like Football a Super game. Bowl. Yeah. Was, yeah. You would literally be like, get in the car bitch, we're gonna miss Drag Race. Like we're going I to the bar. I remember that, yeah. Like we would all like, we'd, have to be on time at the bar because we didn't have a logo. So we're watching Jinx's season and the commercial comes on, Rue Done It. And it's on YouTube. Now I'll put it in. And it's literally a commercial about who stole Sharon's crown. <laughs> logo presents Rue Done It. My crown, it's missing. You need to find the queen that stole my crown. Did the culprit leave any clues? Oh. And you're just like a kid at the bar like, Literally, no, not just me, bitch. Every single person who was at the after party that knew we all are at this bar, we all go. <laughs> after a while, I got over it. And then I was like, I'm just going to post a picture of me wearing it. So she said it as her Facebook profile picture. <laughs> I was like, I'm just, yeah, whatever. So who I said stole it. stole Sharon's crown? on international television well, and she, a random girl in Atlanta set literally. up her profile picture on Facebook, friends <laughs> with tons of drag race girls. Random ass girl in Atlanta. Like nobody knew. Crown, there's the crown. What the? My crown. Literally, nobody knows who I am. No one's ever heard of me before in their lives. And I'm like, I'm gonna post a picture of me wearing it. And what? Post it as my Facebook profile picture. And then what happened? And then it was like, articles came out. Then the local newspaper picks it up. You're such a scandalous person. I know, it never stops. Oh my God. Like I'm telling you guys, my whole life has been scandalous. Escandalo. You know what happened next? They said, hey, want to be on Drag Race? Literally, <laughs> literally, <laughs> literally. Sharon has the crown back because my friends are radical. They were all radical <laughs> fairies. And like, I guess Sharon's like friends, radical fairies too. I don't really know. What the fuck is going on? Atlanta. 